Hi, I'm Preeti Malani, the University of Michigan's Chief Health Officer. The term hitting the wall comes from distance running. It's that moment, usually in a marathon, when your energy is depleted and feelings of overwhelming fatigue and negativity set in. COVID has consumed us for nearly a year and many people are hitting the pandemic wall. And although there's not one simple way of making everything better, there are things each of us can do to take care of ourselves and each other. Uncertainty plays a big part in hitting the pandemic wall. It's hard to plan for next week, much less next semester and beyond. Remember, this is an extraordinarily difficult time. So be kind to yourself and do the best you can. Think about the things that create stress for you, a roommate, a particular friend, social media, the news, your academic work. Are there ways to better control and manage the stress? For example, Maybe you can put your phone away for a few hours and take a little break from Instagram. Whenever possible, surround yourself with people that bring positive energy. And on the flip side, make sure you also bring positive energy to others. Take care of your body. Get some physical activity and fresh air each day and think about what you're eating and drinking. Get enough sleep. Being connected to others is so important. It's a big part of your mission experience. Loneliness on campus isn't new, but the pandemic has undoubtedly made it worse. The bigness of our campus can make it hard for some students to find their people. What I tell my own children is to think about what you can do, not what you can't do. There's so many good examples of students finding ways to make friends and stay connected, virtually or in small groups, but it does require more effort this year. Many students have also found meaning by helping others. So please share your talents with the entire community. And for those students who are struggling with the disruption brought on by the pandemic, it's often helpful to talk through things with someone. Now, there are no wrong doors, but a few options include wellness coaching through Wolverine Wellness, counseling services at CAPS, your academic advisors, and of course, the Dean of Students Office. This continues to be a difficult time for the entire community. Let's remember to show one another kindness and patience as we keep moving forward.